Hey there, minimalist enthusiasts and seekers of simple living. Welcome back to our channel. Today, we're diving into a topic that's near and dear to our hearts. The things in your home that you probably don't need. Yes, you heard me right. We're going to talk about 20 plus common items that might be cluttering up your space and mind. So let's declutter and embrace a more minimalist lifestyle together. First up on our list is single-use kitchen gadgets. You know, those gadgets that only serve one purpose and take up valuable drawer space. Say goodbye to that avocado slicer and garlic press. Next is excessive kitchen utensils. How many spatulas does one person really need? Keep the essentials and donate the rest. Next is unused cookbooks. Let's be real, most of us look up recipes online now. Those cookbooks sitting on your shelf are just collecting dust. Number four is magazines and newspapers. In the digital age, physical subscriptions often go unread. Opt for di digital versions to save space and reduce paper clutter. After that is DVDs and CDs. With streaming services and digital downloads, physical media is becoming obsolete. Consider dig digitizing your collection and donating the disc. After that it would be old electronics. That outdated phone from 5 years ago, it is time to let it go. Recycle or sell old electronics responsibly. In number 7 we have excess bedding and linens. How many spare sheet sets do you really need? Simplify your linen closet by keeping just what you re regularly use. In addition, we have unused clothes. If you haven't worn it in the past year, chances are you won't wear it again. Donate or sell clothes you, lo you no longer need. After that, it would be mismatched hangers. A set of uniform hangers can streamline your closet's appearance and make it easier to find what you need. At number 10, we have obsolete office supplies. Do you really need that stack of outdated business cards? Declutter your desk by getting rid of supplies you no longer need. Unused stationery. That collection of cute notebooks might be tempting, but if you never use them, they're just taking up space. And excessive furniture. Consider whether each piece of furniture serves a purpose or if it's just taking up valuable floor space. Number 13, expired toiletries and makeup. Check the expiration dates on your beauty products and toss anything that's past its prime. Unused hair tools. Do you really need three different types of curling irons? Simplify your hair care routine by keeping only what you use regularly. And excessive towels. Keep a few towels for everyday use and donate the rest to free up space in your linen closet. Number 16 would be junk mail and flyers. Sort through your mail regularly and recycle anything that's not essential. And unused sports equipment. That, that dusty tremor in the corner, if you're not using it, it's just taking up space. Consider selling or donating unused sports equipment and excessive knickknacks. Clear surfaces or unnecessary clutter to create a more visually appealing and calming space. At number 19, we have plastic bags. Invest in reusable shopping bags to reduce waste and declutter your pantry or under sink storage. In addition, we have expired pantry items. Check the expiration dates on canned goods and dry goods and toss anything that's past its prime. Also, unused kitchen appliances. That waffle maker seemed like a great idea at the time, but if it's been collecting dust, it's time to let it go. And there you have it folks, 20 plus common things your home probably doesn't need. By letting go of excess stuff, you can create a more minimalist and simplified living space that's both visually appealing and mentally calming. Remember, it's not about depriving yourself, but rather about surrounding yourself with things that truly add value to your life. Thanks for watching and don't forget to like and subscribe and share with your fellow minimalists. Until next time, stay clutter free.